I'm not even gonna, we're not even gonna play around, so let's just get into it. <laughs> what in the fuck? Here's the thing that's crazy to me, right? I'm gonna get straight into it because it makes absolutely no sense. I need a salad also. It's a chicken salad. The thing that's crazy to me about this whole situation is that I just keep getting the like, on top of, it's wild. A ukulele is wild. But the thing I think that confuses me and bothers me a bit is that she i keep seeing her talk about her making mistakes and just being a loser and dumb and then i just think about she was over she was never a minor during these times yeah i'm pretty sure she wasn't a minor during any of these times at least any of the times i've seen on tiktok recently and she talks about making a mistake M baby girl what no no all right i know that sounds bad a mistake happens maybe once, twice even. You did blackface. You made fun of different races when you were my age. Hell, like I think most of these, or at least a good chunk of them, she was my age. Making that same mistake over and over and over again. And then doing that while also texting children while also sending children underwear while also acting like they were your friends while also having a whole ass baby she's a mother bitch i'm a mother that's the thing that was crazy to me i'm like if any of these things happen to your daughter now and some youtuber said any of this would you be having the same reaction absolutely not unless you're let your cuckoo for cocoa puffs unless that's that's the way it is and that we're just talking to an, a mentally not well person that needs to have their child taken away because if you tell me yes that's bullshit you're not going to be like well this person's paid for it and they took accountability like no that weirdo should have been off of the internet having any interaction with children if the child because i think the thing that's crazy also is that it's not even like half this stuff is just like oh she did this bad thing and she's like a shady person you also have to think about the effect of well, like that girl that she's spreading that child so we're not gonna we're not gonna mention them as anything else but what they are that child that she's spreading on on stage the child she tried to put the, the hand down her pants these children but <laughs> these children had actual reaction they actually feel shitty that one girl still to this day says like that happened at that 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 performance with her and Miranda Sings and like it was just such an embarrassing moment and it was so shitty she still talks about it like that to this day so it's like it's crazy that she's just like I took accountability because I, I maybe maybe I didn't see the video where the girl said that she apologized or etc etc I doubt it happened or I doubt it was it was genuine it was basically like yeah I did a bunch of shitty stuff but I said sorry I kept doing it. I do, I've done it several times. Some of the stuff is repeat offender. I was in blackface. How old do you need to be to know that that's wrong? As a wh young white woman who was working, doing stuff, working with ethnic people, working with people who knew people. For, like, you weren't like a child. Like, that's the thing that's crazy. It's like saying Shane Dawson shouldn't be talked about for the shit he was doing. It was weird. So, low key, low key, a lot of the stuff that she did, I look at how people would shit on Shane Dawson. I'm like, she was right there. she been here. She's had the scandal about her and the text messages with that boy Adam have been a thing. I'm pretty sure I made a video about this. Like, it, why has people not seen this until now? Y'all were all on Jenna Marble's ass. Girl made a whole video whole music video with her character Miranda just didn't even need to she could even if she made a snippet that maybe that makes sense but she made a whole music video being a racist and did whole concerts being racist and or made a whole concert being racist but did racist things in a whole concert like live people these weren't videos that happened to spur the moment these are things that happened consecutively so for her to get here with this with this crazy ass ukulele story being like i took accountability then why are you mad that people are calling you out for bullshit you did when you were a grown-ass adult why are you mad that people are calling you out for stuff that happened to your your child you physically have right now you would look at that person like they were the most disgusting human being on earth and you would never be like well don't worry kiddo like it happened a while ago you need to get over it you would never tell them that. so what i don't understand that's that's the thing that's bothering me i don't even want to make this video long but like it's giving weird i just I don't know. but yeah that was i just I don't even need to make a long video about this because it's enough has been said. You can literally just look at random shit on TikTok, Twitter, of just thing after thing after thing after thing. You know, an example of taking accountability is being like, huh, that shitty thing I did was shitty. Yeah, I was an asshole. You didn't do that. I don't think people understand the word taking accountability anymore. 
part taking accountability is accepting that you were trash. Even saying, well, I was trash, but that's not what it is anymore. It is accepting I'm a trash human being. I suck as a person. And yeah, you should be, You sh if you feel that I was a weirdo and an awful person for the things that I've done consecutively, like several times, like this isn't one, this isn't five to seven times, this is several different things that keep happening that I made a conscious decision to like, if you think I'm a shitty person for that, I totally get it. I totally get it because that was a real shitty thing. It was like, no, 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 you should think I'm a better person now and you should stick by me and thank you for my friends that did because you guys understand how it works. Nah fam, not nah, sis, it's, that's not how it is. But I'm not gonna lie, no shade to people who do this because I like Broadway singers and I like, I like that type of stuff. She give, she's giving theater kid. Oh, this is some type of shit they would do. You're doing it on stage, you think it's funny, it works for you and you, do this really terrible shitty stuff for the sense of entertainment and your craft and the character or whatever the fuck and then coming back years later you're just like yeah i did all that stuff but i'm better now and i'm taking accountability by telling you to stop talking about it that's how it works right this is not abnormal shit but yeah that's all i have to say about it thank you guys for watching I will see you guys later. I don't want to talk about how I've been gone for months and then said several times on my Discord that I was coming back and then it's been four months later. I don't want to talk about it, okay? Be glad that I'm coming back now. Uh, it's depression is the reason, so. But I'm, I'm gonna come back. I'm like talking about stuff again.